today is May 24th, 2015, and we went shopping at Hy-Vee today. Uh, we decided to stop and take a look at the eggs, which we do on occasion, to check prices and see what's available compared to what we have. And we found these Farmer's Hen House cage-free eggs. And we realized that we've been a little short on white egg layers lately, so we decided to do an experiment. We bought a pack of these, and we just happened to have a broody hen at the moment, so we're going to take them out and give them to her. We set them out on the counter here just to let them warm up so we don't give her too much of a chill when we hand them over. But we've heard of other people hatching cage-free organic eggs from Trader Joe's, and so we decided to try our own version of hy V. So we'll see what happens. This is our broody hen. She is a Java. And she's actually very good with us. She has a band on her leg that tells us that she's raised chicks before, so we know we can trust her with some eggs. So we'll put her in here and hopefully she'll she'll like them. Easy girl. come back we'll probably do a an, an initial candling in about a week about a week see if any of them are, are growing and if they are we'll let her continue now we'll close her up here we are candling the uh, high V eggs that we put under a broody she's had them for 10 days this one here looks like it might be a dud. We'll go through them all and see, see what they look like. See anything in there? You? Nope. She's down to nine eggs. She knocked several of them out of her nest. That one doesn't look like anything. Yep. This one is growing. Can you see the veins in the video? I got some veins and I wonder if I can. Oh yeah, can you see the movement? It's moving around in there. So this one is good to go. There you go. Let's see what else we got. Oh, that looks like another dud. Oh, this one looks promising too. Let's see if we can get it moved around to. I don't know. I'd say that's something. Yeah. Oh, it is moving around. Did you see that? Yep. Did you see over there on the left side? There's a little chick moving around in there. 
got two so far, Mom. There you go. You can take it back. There you go. Let's see. It looks like another dud. So 10 days is about halfway for the eggs. Well, got nothing. That looks like nothing also. This looks like we may have two takers. Two takers. Two leghorns. We'll see if they actually make it. But that's everything. All right, we'll give them a shot. Today is Monday, June the 15th, and Miss Broody's chicks were due yesterday. Nothing happened, the eggs were duds. So we were ready to give up on them, and we were giving her till today just in case. And I came out here tonight. Goats are knocking things over. I found she's still got one egg. What you got in there, Miss Brody? And look at that. One of our eggs hatched. We have a little leghorn peep. So, she's at least got one. I think maybe because they were refrigerated before we gave them to her, it may have taken them a little longer than normal to get moving. And so this one's actually a day late hatching. So we'll give it back to mom. I'm gonna take the broken egg out. And I guess we'll give this one back to her, maybe till tomorrow, and she'll probably abandon it at that point. But we got one. Look, <laughs> look,